Our next one joining the stage is Ferdy. Uh, let's give a big applaud as well. And here we go with a clicker microphone. Right. Ready to do some. Uh, Actually, you know what, here's your time and enjoy a lot. Oh, thank you. Can Perfect. I put this in Okay, there? good. Thank you. Well, folks there, hello. You know what, guys? I got a solution, a tip for you here. If you have a resource, use it. If you have a car, share it with Faraday. We are your convenient car sharing solution. And by convenient, that means, guys, if you own a vehicle, if you are a private owner, if you're a business owner, you can put your car into our system. People can instantly be able to locate, open this directly from the app, and pay, submit payment directly there. We take a 30% commission from that, guys. But you know what? There's a lot of money in 30%. About 1.2 million over two years. But that's conservative because you know what? There's a 41% growth rate in this here. And you know what, guys? There are some people in this, this industry already. You know about car sharing. You've heard about it a little bit. But when it comes to peer-to-peer -peer car sharing, when it comes to using existing vehicles, it's a mess, guys. When it comes to get around, drive the auto levy, if you want to share your car, you put your vehicle in the system, you have to actually physically give your key to people. When they want to actually book your car, you have to actually confirm it manually every single time someone actually wants to rent that. That is a mess because people are saying, the users are actually saying what they value is convenience. This is why we have built the most convenient peer-to-peer -peer car sharing technology out there. Our hardware and our software makes it possible for you to share your vehicle without actually having to have any kind of physical key exchange or any interaction in that sense there. But we don't just stop there, okay guys? We're currently building an actual universal car sharing solution. So using the technology that we already have, we're further developing this right now to have a system where you can actually plug this in yourself as a car owner. You don't need any kind of external installation process. That's what we're building. And how do you know we're going to get there? Because we've done so much so far. With our technology, we've already developed this in less than a year, guys. The best car sharing, P2P car sharing solution so far. We've got the pre-seed funding that got us going there, and the Tech is KKS grant. We have first corporate customers like Walt and Smartly.io happily using our technology and using our tech to develop or to deliver their food and such and their food delivery services. We've had a small but mighty team here, guys. We actually four founders here and five co-founders who have made a great impact on this, and we're looking for the right people to get in with us here. Now, when it comes to this, guys, we're looking for people to join for our beta as a driver, as a user. Um, feel free to sign up. We launch as open beta in two weeks. And of course, if you're interested, we've got a 200 and uh, 50K seed round that you're welcome to join in. So talk to us, ask some questions. Happy to talk to you guys. Woo. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, actually, Biz, how does the technology work? Like, how does it work that yeah, I don't need to give some of my, my keys or handover process? You don't have to do that, actually. So here's what ha Oh, they had to pass that over. Okay, yes. They put it back on. All right, so actually what you have to do is right now in our beta, you get the hardware installed. It's actually pretty quick as is, but what we're doing is right now, we're taking measurements on everyone's car to make certain it's universal. So in the beta period, you come in or we go to you, we install it very quickly in a half hour. And essentially, from there on, you don't have to interact with anybody anymore, okay? Very good. Mm -hmm. Harry? Uh, I typically ask myself three questions when they're listening to, to the startups. First, what is the opportunity big like hell? Secondly, what is the unfair competitive advantage? And thirdly, where is the team to make the vision to happen? Okay. You clearly have the vision. But you, have to, you have the team and you have the upside. That's huge. But why you? What is the unfair competitive advantage with you guys? Yes. The unfair advantage. Sorry, if you could turn around so you... Oh, so sorry, guys. All right. yeah. Nice to see you here. <laughs> yeah, the unfair advantage for this, actually, for us, because we have this convenient system and we've been working with customers and we have these customers that are larger companies, say, for instance, like Walt. These people happen to have high concentrations of our user base. That's one big deal for us. That means when we go and we start off with these customers, we actually have all their employees in their, co in their company able to use our vehicles, and they actually are very good proselytizers for us. So we have an opening in every single market that we enter with our corporate our partners already. And also, of course, for the vehicles that are in our fleet full-time, 
one thing is people can actually request to have one of those full-time vehicles placed near them. So we know where the vehicles need to be, we know where the demand is in advance. So far in this metro Helsinki area, we've identified 79 areas where we can make a profitable return on the vehicle. That's actually a big part about us. Yep. Thank you very much. I think that's one more if yet. That's all the questions. More will be done afterwards, and, and hopefully we can talk later. So big applause. Thank you very much for Fernie.